Merry Christmas! <laughs> Hola chicos! Hi guys and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Uh, Merry Christmas! <sighs> I hope you all had a wonderful Christmas day. No matter what you did, no matter where you were, no matter what you ate, no matter what you got, I hope you were surrounded by love. Today, I'm bringing you the what I got for Christmas video. I know I'm late, okay? I know I'm late, but I thought from the 25th of December until the 31st, it's, Chris, it's bloody Christmas, that this whole time, this whole period. So I thought it's never too late to get this video out to you guys. And I know I promised I'd be like better at getting videos up. However, <laughs> I mean, I'm just really, really bad at it. Um, I am in no way, shape or form putting this video up to show off to show off how spoiled I am or anything like that. The simple reason I'm doing it is because I love watching these videos. I love seeing what people get up to and what they got for Christmas. I love everything down to what chocolate they got and what kind of socks they got. You're probably wondering why I'm sitting on the floor right now. Which actually, you probably wouldn't have known that unless I said it. <laughs> oh. There is actually behind this curtain a radiator. So I am currently in my homeland. I'm in my natural habitat, which is Scotland. It has been lovely. And in all honesty, that is better than any present I will ever have, you know, because I got to see my brother for the first time in two years, not long. So it's been a really good Christmas this year. Christmas 2018 will be one to top. So I am just gonna go through a couple of the little things I got for Christmas this year. I have been spoiled rotten this year and I'm very very grateful and very blessed. Um, but let's go. I'm gonna show you what I got. As I said this is not a video to show off, none of that. I just personally love watching these videos so I wanted to do one. I wanted to make one and I got some pretty cool gifts this year so I wanted to show you guys. If this is the first time you have come across my channel, or if it's the first video of mine you've seen, please leave me a little Christmas tree in the comments box. I just want to see where I'm at. I just want to see who pays attention. No, I'm just kidding. Um, I'm just really interested to see if this is the first video of mine you have seen. Um, and also, a subscribe would be fabulous as well. If you like my stuff, if you like what I'm trying to do here, <laughs> please hit that subscribe button, it would help me out a lot on my little YouTube journey. So if you have any ideas of what you'd like to see on my channel, I'm gonna do, I'm gonna head towards, more kind of towards the makeup side of things in my next couple of videos, but after that, I'm up for anything. I am completely babbling on now. As always, you know, once you get to know me you realise I just can't stop talking. <laughs> so the first thing that Santa brought me, you might have guessed it already, because the quality of my video has got a lot better. I was treated to a beautiful camera to start this journey to help me along my YouTube adventure. The Sony A5100 and I'm absolutely in love with it. Um, it has changed the game for me already. Um, obviously I can't show you because I'm using it right now but I will pop it down below in the description box if you want to have a look. Obviously I'm still experimenting, I'm still getting used to using a camera, a proper camera. Um, so that was my first gift. I'm very, very, very lucky. Santa, Santa's helped me out. He's, he's feeling that YouTube vibe and he wants me to succeed. Next up, what oh I got. You guys don't know me properly yet, but once you get to know me, if you subscribe to my channel. Is that I am obsessed with household things, I'm obsessed with decorating, I'm also obsessed with cooking. And I was surprised this year by a beautiful Russell Hobb slow cooker. If you don't know what that is, 
I'll try and pop an image here. As I say, I'm not good at editing yet. So maybe the picture's there? Maybe it's not. If not, I'll link that down below as well. If you like cooking, I recommend this. Also, a slow cooker. Pop a chicken in in the morning, go to work, come back, and your chicken's ready. And you can do all sorts of things in there. You can make cakes, you can make mulled wine for Christmas time. There's a, a wide variety of things. I'm going to move on to clothing kind of things now. Um, so, my mother picked me up some skinny jeans. Primark skinny jeans. These are the Shaping Super High Waist Skinny black skinny jeans. They're more like a kind of jegging, but I am very much a jean and boot kind of gal. So these are perfect for these are for like my jean jumper boot kind of days. Um, which you need when you're in Scotland, by the way. So I haven't been to Scotland, back to Scotland. Obviously I live, I live abroad at the minute and oh my god it is cold. <laughs> I was not prepared for this. Next up, I've worn this already. It's from Stratovarius. Struggled to say that shot. This play. So I wore this actually on Boxing Day and it is a see-through. So you wear a little black bralette underneath. Absolutely gorgeous and it's like skin tight. I wore it with a leather, leather skirt? Yep, leather skirt. Gorgeous, love that. Next up, I am in love. I got this beautiful snake skin coat. It's from Zara. It is more of a kind of smart jacket. It's not got a hood, but it's got gorgeous padded shoulders. And I just love it. It's got one zip at the front and two pockets. Two pockets on the front here with zips and unreal. Unreal. This is more of a kind of going out for dinner vibe. But that is gorgeous, nonetheless. Oh, and I got these jammy suit. I also got from Santa the matching boots. Oh yeah. How gorgeous is this? Also from Stratovarius, little bag. It's got two compartments as well, which is great. The only thing is, this is also snake print, so I can't wear it with my snake print. I don't know about anyone else, but I am Ferrero Rocher obsessed. These things are unreal. Mm. Make makeup and cosmetic type things. Um, in terms of makeup, I didn't get too much this year, which is a shock because normally, I mean, I say I didn't get too much. I have plenty of gifts, but normally I ask for a lot of makeup because I do a lot of makeup, I wear a lot of makeup, I work with a lot of makeup. But this year I didn't. But I did ever get. Look at the size of this beauty blender. Look at the size of this beauty blender. Um, I got this for my sister. My sister was like, oh, I wonder why it's so big. It's actually for your body. It's a body beauty blender. It is absolutely huge. However, I could use that on my face easily. It's obviously, it's obviously for contouring up here or maybe adding a bit of tan somewhere, etc, etc. But I can use that on my face. Easily, easily, love that. Next up, a gorgeous little travel set of Morphe makeup brushes. Absolutely love this. I cannot remember what this is called, but I'll pop it down below. Um, this is a travel kit, but it has got everything from face to eyes. Oh, there's an eyebrow one there. I think we're only kind of missing a couple of contour brushes and maybe a lip brush, but in terms of face and eyes, um, they, are, they, are, they are gorgeous. They're like this pearl white. I'm going to take one out to show you. Absolutely love that. Um, so they are gorgeous. I will probably use these ones for me. I travel a lot with work and... Oh, I don't know, but I use Morphe brushes. Morphe brushes are about the only brushes I'll use. Um, I do a lot of makeup work as well. I'm not a professional makeup artist, but I do work with makeup and I do a lot of people's makeup. Um, 
So maybe I'll use them from work or maybe I'll use them for my own face and then just use my old ones for clients. Probably gonna do that. Next up, perfumes. I have confession. It's a weird thing. And I'm not sure how to explain it. I'm obsessed with household kind of things, little trinkets, like little decorations for the house, interior design, that kind of thing. Actually, if you saw my flying tiger haul, you would see how obsessive I am when it comes to little things for the house. So, with perfume, the theme of my little bathroom and my own flat is grey and pink, grey and a, a pale pale baby pink therefore my perfume bottles have to be pink I can't have a blue perfume when the theme of the room is pink now they have an Armani Diamonds Rosé you probably can't see it's rosé on this video but it's just a slight tinge which is perfect so that I was very lucky to get two perfumes this year. So I got the Armani Diamonds Rosé. And I also got, which is still in the box, this smells great. I've had Hugo Boss before, um, but it's in a different style bottle. I'm going to show you this one. This is a nice bottle as well. This is also pink. Because it matches my bathroom, okay? The thing is, people know me and people know if you're going to buy me a perfume, it has to be a pink one. Just saying. So now on to little homey kind of lifestyle things. Love this stuff. I think it's from Primark. Santa brought me one of these. It is a, what does it say? Makeup remover cloth removes makeup with just water. Probably not gonna do the just water idea because that sounds horrendous for your skin. But, nevertheless, it's a flannel. These things are good for getting your makeup off. Um, so I put my cleanser on or whatever I'm using to rub my makeup, wash it off with this and then after use my toner etc to get the rest of the things off it. It really depends what your kind of routine is. So you could also use it as it's, it's, it's like a flannel, you could pop hot water on this and just let it rest on your face to open up all your pores before you do your skincare routine. Love this. Next up, which is really cute, I have no idea where it's from. But my, my sister got me this. It's just a little plate. It's tiny. It's like a little saucer. It's pink, a kind of marble grey, and then a rose gold H. H for hope. Me. Love this. This is really cute. This is very me. You saw, if you watched my, if you watched my Flying Tiger video, I love little trinkets like this. I love I love personalised things as well. Something with my initials, something something that's to do with me. <laughs> because you know it's all about me. My house is full of things full of things with H on it. So there's another little thing. One of my last little gifts, love this. Santa brought me this as well. It's my diary, my 2019 diary. Um I another thing you get to know me guys in this video. I'm very organised. I'm a very organised person. It's a, a week to a page on this side. But then on this side, it's got to-do lists, it's got a motivational quote, any appointments you've got, your goals for the week. There's a little box if you want to make a note. I am about this life. Absolutely. It's got a pen in it as well. It's, it's very soft as well. And last, but never least is one of the most unique presents I've ever got now if you follow on Instagram a lovely lady called Mrs Hinch she has an Instagram it's called Mrs Hinch home and she has a beautiful home that she shares on Instagram and she cleans and she's funny and yeah basically and she's got lovely little taglines and she calls all of our she calls all of her cleaning products and all of her cloths different names and she's just generally hilarious and really her, this year her Instagram has just boomed and congratulations to her because <laughs> she is smashing 
2018 and she is going to smash 2019 um, but yeah if you're into cleaning if you're into little household things that's like me that's why I love her so much because I love cleaning and I love household things and decor and all that kind of stuff and she's very organized she likes lists like me as well you know I mean that's why we get on so <laughs> you know we just we just click <laughs> <laughs> I need to stop. So, Mrs. Hinge at this moment in time has absolutely zero merch. Um, I'm, I presume she will have merch at some point. So, please don't believe this is real merch because it's not. This is just, actually, it's nothing to do with Mrs. Hinge really. But my sister got these personalised for me. These are boxes. Little baskets. One says cloths, one says clean, and one says Zaflora. Zaflora is a personal favourite of Mrs. Hinge. It's a like a disinfectant um, solution. But Mrs. Hinge herself has baskets like these underneath her sink where she can organise all her cleaning products. I mean, that is a bit of me. And now I have these personalised ones that are really, really, really cool. As I say, these are not official merch, merchandise of Mrs. Hinch. Um, my sister got these printed and made for me, which are really cool. I just love them so much. I'm a perfectionist and that's how I work. That, that's how I roll. Um, so there's not much more I can organise in my house. Well, I didn't think so until I got these cool boxes. I didn't think I could be more organised until I got these cool boxes. So I'm really excited. Don't know how I'm gonna get them in my suitcase home, but I'll organize that. Also, if you wanna, if you want some videos on how I organize, um, how I organize my kitchen, how I clean my kitchen, how I've decorated some bits and bobs around my house, how I prepare my lists for the week. So if that's something you want to see, please let me know in the comments down below, whether it's how I get up in the morning, to my cleaning routine at night time, um, anything like that, anything organisy or household related, I am ha I'm, a, I'm happy to video something like that. If you want to give me some ideas down below in the comments section. Anyway, that concludes today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. I love everything that is in front of me. From this tiny little plate to this amazing camera that I'm sitting here using. I can't believe how lucky I've been this year. Santa is a great man. And don't forget if this is one of the first videos of mine that you have seen it, please leave me a little Christmas tree emoji down below in the comment section. And don't forget to smash that like button. Give me a big thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. And I will see you guys so soon for another video. I hope you guys enjoy the rest of the festive season. I hope you have a wicked time. Please be safe, please look after yourselves, but enjoy yourselves at the same time. Bye! Oh, I've got pins and needles! Oh my god, I can't move my leg. Oh my god, I actually can't move my leg right now. Oh my god, I'm absolutely sweating. Back in a bad Christmas tree.